Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Zeke the Crypto Miner, and today I'm gonna tell you about mining in 2017. Uh, only your own mining form, around me later, but only your own mining form in 2017. Uh, I started late 2017. This is my story. It was going good at first, it was going really good at first, and then because I'm new into cryptocurrency and I jumped in in a rush, I jumped in a hurry. And it ended up still being pretty good, but not as good as everyone thought it was going to be. So, when I first started, uh, I built my own mining machine. Machine I had six uh, RX 570s mining Ethereum and Decree and sometimes some other coins to get a profit. So, to my initial start for those mining machines was around $2,000 to build. A six GPU mining machine, and when I got it, I started mining Ethereum, and, and the prices at the hash rate I was supposed to get an extra thirteen thousand dollars in a year for mining, almost fifteen thousand dollars if the price stayed where it's at. Ethereum at the time was like four hundred dollars, so um, I mined, and then the difficulty kept going up, and then I kept mining, difficulty kept going up, and the thing with my mining rig is that. Uh, I kept getting the error GPU watchdog error. So you keep you have to keep on monitoring your GPUs and monitoring uh, your your rigs and restarting them and updating the software and this and that. So a lot of times my my rig was not running at 100%, which was very frustrating. Sometimes I go out of town and the rig completely go down. So that's when I got into cloud mining. So I was cloud start cloud mining on Hashflare. And I started cloud mining on Genesis Mining. Genesis Mining is sold out right now. So right now I'm just buying uh, Terra hashes over on Hashfair if you guys want to mine. But um, so from my mining rig, I say I accumulated, let's see, around like five to six Ethereum coins. So Ethereum at the time, right now is $300. So three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, thousand five hundred dollars so did I get my profit back from the mining rig? No, I didn't. But I made five Ethereum coins, right? So if the price of Ethereum goes up anymore, will I make my profit? Of course I will. And Ethereum should go up from 2017, 18, and 19. So if I hold on to those five Ethereum coins, I will have a lot of money, right? But what if I just had that $2,000 that I initially invested and bought Ethereum, well, then I would be losing money because I would have bought it when Ethereum was at $400 and Ethereum is now at $300. So mining was better than buying, even though I only made $1,500 and it's $2,000. And let me tell you why it was the best investment I ever did. Because I made five coins and I still had six GPUs, the power supply, the motherboard, in the CPU so I sold all six of my GPUs for their they are used cards and they are still going for two hundred and nine dollars three hundred and thirty five dollars two hundred and thirty dollars over on eBay so I sold all six and I sold my motherboard oh my god I'm making a video I saw my motherboard CPU and power supply and I got back more money than I paid to build the rig. So after selling all my GPUs, because they were set, they're selling for more than what I bought them for uh, from the store. I'm selling more on eBay, so I made an extra two hundred dollars from selling it, from selling all my parts to the rig. So now that was two thousand two hundred dollars plus the extra five free coins that I got. So that. That's why building your rig was the most profitable thing I could have done. So I made $200 from selling my rig and five free Ethereum coins from mining. So that was an awesome, awesome, awesome experience. Now let me tell you about the worst decision I made. Now you guys know that I bought some Antminer D3s at the time that I bought them. If I would have had, if, they, if I bought them and they shipped it off and they mailed it to me the very next week and I plugged them up, I would have made... I was supposed to be making $120,000 in a year. Pretty much that's what the difficulty was at. But as the when you order from Bitmain, 
they hold on to your order for two months and it takes them like seven days to ship it so because they wasn't released they release them in batches so let's say this one's not shipping until December this one's not shipping until next year so once you buy it they won't ship it until months after you buy them and this why when I by the time we all got our D3s mailed to us and we started mining we were literally making it was costing more to mine with um, your power cost than you were making. So when you when you first order, you're supposed to make a hundred dollars a day. I was making ten dollars a day by the time I got it. So I mined for a little bit. I almost got one full dash out of it, and then dash shot up to four hundred dollars. And then I was like, let me hurry up and sell these. Now the thing with buying mining machines like this is that they are not resellable as much as RX 570s or GTX 1080s because you can't do anything else with this. So I put these on eBay and I sold both of them and I just had to take my loss. So I live, I learn, I want you guys to learn from my mistakes and I want you guys to learn from what I'm doing correct so that you guys don't make the same mistake I made. I'm not stingy like that. I don't want to hold information. I'm going to let you guys know what I do right. I'm going to let you guys know when I do wrong and we can talk as a community to help grow each other in this cryptocurrency world. But yeah, that was the one bad experience I had so far with cryptocurrency was buying the and mining D3s. And the most positive experience I had mining in 2017 was building my own rig because I profited a lot, a lot, a lot. And if Ethereum ever goes up to $1,000, I profited, I profited, I profited a lot, a lot, a lot of money. But in that, uh, you guys comment down in the comment section if you have your own rig. I think about building your own rig. Um, hit the thumbs up for this video. Subscribe to the channel. There's a lot more information like this to come. But yeah, this is Zeke the Crypto Miner. I'm out.